take my uncle. You love your uncle. Tell him about your uncle. Tell him how you feel about your uncle. I'm sad. I want him back. That's my only son. And I'm gonna miss it. Grandma. I would have rather him shoot me, beat me with an axe. Not my baby. Not him. 25-year-old Carlos Collins was murdered early Tuesday morning, heading back to his apartment after work. Police say they are looking for Marcus Johnson, a former Jackson police officer. Early Tuesday morning, officers responded to Tapestry Northridge Apartments on Parkway Drive in Jackson, Mississippi, and found Carlos Collins suffering from multiple wounds caused by multiple objects. Carlos had apparent wounds from both a firearm and an axe. Both had been used repeatedly on his body leading up to his death. It did not take officers long to name a suspect. Carlos had previously been in a relationship with 33-year-old Marcus Johnson, and at some point the relationship ended and Marcus didn't take it well. Things had gotten so bad that Carlos took out multiple restraining orders against Marcus over several months. Despite the restraining orders that Carlos had in place, Marcus continued to violate them as recent as the Saturday before Carlos's death. Everyone has multiple ring cameras. His friends, they live here too. He's always lurking around, prowling around. You put a ring camera on a vacant apartment watching him. That's like obsession. That's a problem. And I feel like the law should have protected him and they failed him multiple times. Marcus is a former police officer with the Jackson Police Department. He worked there for about eight months in 2013 before he was allowed to resign prior to his immediate termination. He was being terminated for disciplinary actions that have not been specified. Marcus was subsequently arrested in 2014 and charged with impersonating an officer at the Palisades Apartments near Jackson State University. Apparently in that incident, Marcus wrote a fake citation to a female student and then tried to quote, hook up with her in order to avoid the ticket. He was charged with false pretense, grand larceny, and two counts of impersonating an officer. Marcus had been listed as being armed and dangerous and for people to be on the lookout for him, but he was subsequently captured after leading police on a chase, crossing into the Louisiana state lines. But before he was arrested, this is what Carlos's family had to say. Lord, help me! Somebody turn him in, Lord! Turn him in! Collins' aunt, Glory Jean Hudson, says her nephew came to see her last Thursday. And he said, Aunt Jean, I bought your steak. I bought this. I said, well, Carlos, I got your blueberry pie. Take it home, put half in the refrigerator, and eat the other. But I didn't know that would be the last time I see my nephew. In Yazoo City, Police, I want you to find Marcus for killing my uncle.